The highlights were things like, like the, the big move to version 8, where we started out very early, basically in November of 2015, where we set out for PHP 7 only, so we made that the, the, the minimum requirement for, for uh, the project. And luckily, more people followed down that road. Our move to use PHP 7 so early in the release cycle was mainly that we have like an 18 month release cycle. So we were thinking what would happen by the day we release, what would be the supported PHP version, that being PHP 7. On the other hand, PHP 7 offers so much technological advantages. Just besides pure performance, that's, that, that's a nice like bit on top. But, um, it allows us to write much cleaner code, execute faster, have less hassle with, with, with coding issues. It allows better architecture and that, was, that were basically the main reasons why we chose PHP 7 in the first place. Then we integrated Doctrine, um, which was like on the wish list of the community for a long, long time. Um, which was basically, I think, the biggest change we've ever done to Type of 3's code base because it, it, it affects everything, right? So we have a lot of database interaction and we needed to put that in everywhere. Um, then we invested a lot of time into cloud computing technologies and getting our system ready. So the future for PHP and Type of 3 combined is basically, so, so, so we embrace all new PHP technologies very early. So we've been running all our test environments. Um, we, we have like 9,000 tests in Type of 3 that run automatically per merge. Um, and we run those on PHP 7.1 for, I think, three months now. So with all the beta releases and stuff, so we know in advance what's going to break. Um, so we can embrace these things because PHP is, is maturing a lot faster than it used to do and I think that that it's just it's it, it runs a lot of a lot of the web it's run on PHP actually um, more than people would admit it truly does that's um, we, we, we got we got to stick with it and as a, as a PHP community I think we should all embrace the new technology to drive the web forward